you see that? Can you see it? Can you see that? That's what Creator wants. Did you know? What does Creator want? Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Doesn't want to be worshipped. Doesn't want to be... Yeah, but somebody's going to say that that's just a blank book. Ooh. What yeah. Creator wants? We don't like that word, God, because it could oh, appear as something drugs. else. Guns, oil and drugs, or guns, oil and diseases, because that's what profit is. Do you know, I once said, this is my friend Salon, if we buy up some knives and forks and some plates and some cups and sauces, and we get them for like one pound each, and we sell them for two or three pounds each, what do we make? Profit. He says you know nothing about religion. Hmm. So. We're going to be doing a special on this, this is part five, of, we're going to call it, What Creator Wants. And Creator, this is What Creator Wants? Absolutely nothing whatsoever. Zilch, nout, note. Okay? <coughs> so the title of the, this Cack and Mac show is, Are our governments authorities, councils and courts violent to us? What do you think the answer is? Mm. Yes, of course. Hmm. A lot of people are saying the world is a better place than it was before. People do not act they don't know as what it was they like did before. in primitive times. They live in peace in most places. Well, this is, see, this is where it's wrong. They're not violent. Because if you think about the Native Americans, not those that invaded and, and, and are running the place now, but yeah. the Native Americans, they lived in harmony with everything around them. And with nature too. Yes. So that was better than now. Hmm, I agree. It says um, they live in peace in most places and they're not violent. No, they are not. Most individuals are not, and this is creator speaking. I'll tell you something about Neil Donald Walsh. He was, we've gone over him before, he did conversations with God. He was also in The Secret. He, he was, wasn't he? Yeah. Mm. He's quite boring to listen to. But when he channels the Creator, and he says, the Creator says, I use the word God and heaven and hell and stuff because you understand these words. But there are no such things. We're all one. Anyway, he vented wait, his wait, anger. Wait, wait, wait. If there's no hell, then I've got nothing to fear about dying. Absolutely. Well, then, then I won't be in fear, and then they'll lose their control over me. Correct. There you go. Just cured your fears. Quite interesting, isn't it? So, um, it says, um, most individuals are not. Um, we can agree on that, but we can agree on this. Collectively, humanity is unceasingly and increasingly violent with its own kind. Yes. Is it? Okay. Yes. Is allowing people to go hum uh, homeless a form of violence? Yes. Is allowing people to go hungry a form of violence, like if they've got to use food banks? Yes, if you've got the ability so that they wouldn't need to do it, that or the other, then yes, that's a form of violence. <laughs> is placing life-saving drugs and the finest medical care out of reach of millions a form of violence? Yes. Okay. Is underpaying labourers while taking huge front office profits, a bit like the council does, a form of violence? Yeah, absolutely. Is mistreating, underpaying, denying promotions to, and mutilating females a form of violence? Of course. Oh, that's disgusting. Is racial prejudice a form of violence? Yes. Absolutely, there is no race. Right? If there was, you thought someone would have run it by now. Well, now is the big one that you've always been going on about. And I've got sick of it this morning. I'm sick of hearing about it. And I'm sick of mind control. I'm sick of religions. And I'm sick of... How negative other selves, as I've been calling them, and what they've been doing. Right? And very few people seem to, There's only a few of them. There's millions of us. It's like in that movie about the ants, when the locusts, you know, if they ever figure out they outnumber us by a million to one, they might do something about it. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Okay, I'd like to ask you this, and I know this is um, something you've been going on about for years now. Is child abuse a form of violence? Absolutely. Is child labour a form of violence? Yes. Is child slavery a form of violence? Of course. Is slavery full stop a form of violence? Well, yeah, we are all slaves after all. Is modern slavery a form of violence? Definitely. And that's going on now, it's a form of violence, isn't yep. it? 
right? It's child prostitution and child trafficking a form of violence. Definitely. That's going on now, isn't it? And it's a form of violence. Yeah. Right? And child soldiering. Yeah. Is that a form of violence? Right? Is the death penalty a form of violence? Yeah. Well, you, you're letting somebody... It is a form of violence, but you're letting somebody go straight back home. Yeah. Don't go and try and commit suicide. It's always your choice, but if you do, I assure you that there, there, there are things that, that, that happen. You don't learn your lesson, and you're still going to come back here to learn your lesson. And those that are poisoning this planet in the form of violence upon others, yeah. they've actually got to come back to this effluvent, effluvent but, but the way this mess. The way I see things, what they will actually have to do is come back as the children that they've been raping. So they'll come back and be raped. Their choice is always. Oh, hold on, let's do some occult things. <laughs> you know what they say now? We're Illuminati, look. Not, not, is it Illuminati? Yeah, whatever. A bunch of idiots. We don't do occult things. We are not government. We are co-creators. Okay? And if I touch my chin, I touch this, I touch my head like that, I, I might be thinking. Though. He was doing this the other day. I watched it last night. It was going like <laughs> this. So to him. <laughs> Raving mad pal. Okay. But... You've got to be mad to live in this world at the present. It's insanity, isn't it? If you think this is normal, you're definitely crazy. <laughs> i tell you what's not normal. It's one of the richest countries in the world, the USA, PLC. Well, supposedly the richest right. country in the world. Are the stingiest, stingiest country in the world. Well, their government is anyway. It's, um, oh, we were, we were just having lunch and we had a bit of fun. It said, um, oh, look, I've uh, I've got a cheque to sign here for a new homeless centre in Nottingham. Uh, could you sign it, please? Uh, no. No. Got no, no money. Got no money. Um, there's a war. Where do you want me to sign? How much do you want? <laughs> <laughs> there's always money for war. <laughs> for the homeless. No, 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 no don't be silly. I'm, have a blank cheque. Exactly. That's so, how it works. So to conclude the video, the Cack and Mac show <coughs> is creating and maintaining a worldwide society in which exploitation, oppression and injustice are commonplace. Is that a form of violence? Yes. Yeah? Ignoring suffering is as much a form of violence as inducing it. So you mean like when those criminals, the US and UK and France and Germany and all the other criminals invaded the sovereign country of Iraq and Libya and Afghanistan Syria and killed millions millions, well, millions and millions of people yeah was that a form of violence of course, absolutely but why, so, why, to, uh, why didn't anyone up in oh wait there were two million protested in London and what did they do just uh, ignored them it's millions thousands of protests in France what did they do shoot them with rubber, rubber bullets, bullets yeah. and spray chemicals on them I'd like to ask the police the French police the gendarmerie is that the correct word? Gendarmes. Gendarmes. <coughs> Who are you working for? You are here to protect and serve the public, aren't you? Oh, yes. Yeah? So how come you're violent towards us? How come you're not protecting us? Because we've learned, because we've done it for so long now, that we can be violent to you and we never get charged with it. We get off every single time. Am I a slave? Are we all slaves? Well, yes. Didn't you used to work for the people, and now you're working for... Yeah, well, well when they had those titats, yeah. that was when they worked for the people. Now they're all militarised. So, who is it who's committing violence on this planetary game sphere, this video game that we're co-creators of? Government. So the government and religions. Yes. Yeah, it's always a uh, go to war in the name of God. Yeah. Well, not in our name, thank you very much. We're all co-creators. And I don't... We don't want anything. We certainly don't want you to bow down to us, to pray to us, or to go to war. And, and Creator hasn't got a name. So, uh, did you everybody get it? That it's our servants that are being violent towards us. Mm -hmm. It's our religious teachers that are being our violent to us. supposed servants, because would you pay your servant £80,000 a year? No chance. 
and pay them anything. They're not worth anything. I, 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 be, I honestly believe that all wages should be the same across the board, no matter what you do. Well, look what's happened in the news this week, my friend. MPs in uh, in England, in the UK, PLC, Private Limited Corporation, just got a two thousand pound pay rise. Pay rise increase. That leads the most average monsters of Parliament, as he calls them, which I kind of like, earn seventy nine thousand four hundred and seventy something pounds a year, and plus expenses. Oh yes, well, if you look at expenses plus by expenses. itself, I think uh, Anna Subri. She claimed a hundred and four over a hundred and forty thousand pounds oh, oh, in expenses love you, baby. on top of her wages. How much? A hundred and forty thousand pounds. Even to the point she went to a remembrance. That's not tax deductible, is it? <laughs> yeah. Maybe Even to the point she went to a remembrance uh, parade and charged the fifteen quid for the flowers to us. And these are supposed to be our public servants, and hmm. they're committing violent acts against us and others. Self-serving. Are you still putting up with that? Speaking of violent acts, there's one thing I'd like to add on to the Cack and Mac show, which I haven't mentioned to you yet. And you know the British military, which is the Royal? Ah, yes. The, the armed forces have now got their own chemical regiment. Was that brought about because of uh, Novichek? We've now, in England, we've got a, a chemical regiment. Funnily Can you believe that? Funnily enough, yesterday was the anniversary of the Novichok um, well, MI5, surprise, MI6 surprise. attack. It was yesterday that they announced the new chemical regiment. And, Royal and, chemical and regiment. In uh, Over in Ireland, they had them all up in their chemical suits because something had gone off at uh, the uh, NHS place, apparently. Hmm. Of course, we have to blame Russia for that then. Oh, yeah, 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 definitely. Whatever it is at the moment, blame Russia. No matter what, blame Russia. Oh, the food tastes bad at school. Gotta put me badge on. Blame Russia. Yeah. So there you go. Vlad sent me that for the phone call I did with him yesterday. Vladimir. Do you know, it's, it's surprising what the RT are putting out, some really interesting stuff, and it completely goes against everything else. That'll be why the British government's tried to get them banned then. Yeah. Uh, I remember what Vladimir Putin said a couple of weeks ago, and he's <coughs> like, we want to do business with America and everybody else. So what does that tell you? Better all violent criminals! Seems that way. Ta-da! That's the Kaka Mac show.